What's up guys, it's Glitch Gaming here and in today's video I'm going to be showing you a brand new car duplication glitch on GTA 5 Online. So if you are new to my channel, make sure to subscribe and turn on post notifications so you do not miss out on any of the latest GTA 5 Online money glitches. And if you haven't already checked it out, I am hosting a big Christmas giveaway with a few other YouTubers, so make sure to go and check out that out. The link and all of the steps will be in the description. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you a brand new duplication glitch, which was literally found last night. So the founders to this glitch are Bocker Boy and Broom Tango. So make sure to go and check their channels out. Big shout out to them. The channel links will be in the description, so go and subscribe over there. And I just want to say a big shout out to Bocker Boy for letting me use his gameplay also as I've been very busy today and I don't have time to record so he's just hit 2,000 subscribers so make sure to go and click the link and let's get him to 3,000 and I just want to quickly say tomorrow I will be uploading a solo money glitch as a lot of people have been asking for a solo money glitch it's not the best one but it's the only one we have at the moment so look forward to that that will be tomorrow's video so apart from that I hope you do enjoy the video and I'll see you next time peace Okay my dudes, so to get started on this first ever money glitch and car duplication glitch to come out of the brand new facility, you will need one friend and both of you will need to own the same facility. Now your friend is going to need an Avenger, so that is the person that is helping you duplicate the cars is going to need an Avenger and you will also need an MOC. I'm not too sure if you you yourself that is duplicating the cars will need an Avenger, but your friend definitely needs one. So, you will see here I'm going to duplicate the LG Retro Custom that you can see up there, and the rest of the slots in the facility just fill with stock LG RHAs. So, the one that is duplicating the cars, you just want to be inside your own facility and you want to be sitting inside any of the stock LJ RH8s. You're gonna start up a CEO organisation and you're gonna send an invite to your friend. You're also gonna head down and hover over the retire after you have done that. So, as you can see here, I'm just going to send an invite to Bruntango and I'm going to sit hovering over the retire. Right guys, so this is the point of view of the friend that is helping you to duplicate the cars. They just want to be standing inside the back of their Avenger and inside their own facility while you are sitting in the stock elegy. Once they see the invitation for the CEO organisation come up, they just want to open their cell phone and bring up the invitation page like this. Walk up the ramp at the back of the Avenger and they're going to spam X on PlayStation or A on Xbox. And as soon as the screen goes black, they're going to tell you now. Now back to your point of view, duping the cars. When your friend says now that he has the black screen, you're just going to spam X on PlayStation or A on Xbox to retire as CEO. And once you've done that, you should see your friend's big vehicles like these, trucks etc, spawn inside your facility. And if you do, that is a good sign. If you have them and yours disappears, that is also a good sign. Now, from here, your friend is just going to really hang about your facility and wait on you finishing the glitch. All you have to do at this point is get out of the stock LG RH8 and head down to the vehicle management. Get the car you're going to duplicate and you're going to move it with any of the stock elegies. As you'll see here in the screen, they are frozen, but the names actually move. From here, all you're going to do is back out of the vehicle management section and head back upstairs to the car you're going to duplicate. Now, guys, this is a really easy glitch. As long as you have all the requirements, then you will hit it no problem. So, as you'll see, the cars still look as if they're in the same positions, but this Retro Custom is now, in fact, a stock Elegy. 
and the stock Elegy is now where my retro custom is. That's where I moved it in the vehicle management. So what you want to do is get into the car that you're going to duplicate, the retro custom, and drive it out. Once you have driven it outside of your facility, you just want to exit the vehicle, request your mobile operation center, and get back in the vehicle. Now, this guys, as you see there, that is a fresh plate. So that has actually taken the plate off of the LJ stock version and there is no need for any custom plates or anything with this glitch guys. So it is absolutely friggin awesome. Now all you're going to do once your MOC has arrived on the map is just simply drive the LJ Retro Custom or whichever car you're duplicating into the back of it. You may get this vehicle storage full alert if you have a car saved in it already. Just make sure it's not one you want to replace. Have a RH8 maybe stored inside there as well. Once you've done that, you're just going to get back in the LG Retro Custom and drive it out of the MOC. And now all you want to do is just head on over to one of your garages or even to Los Santos Customs and sell it. You have, in fact, duplicated the car. Hell yeah! So, the one thing that I will say is if you're going to store the duplicated car in your facility, like I'm going to do in the video, all you want to do is before you drive the car back into your facility is have your friend exit. So, once your friend ex exits, the facility it will change it all back and the glitch will be ready to start again so as you see here the facility is full all I have to do is just head on inside and transfer one of the vehicles to my MOC so what I'll be doing is just transferring any LG RH8 and that way when I'm doing the glitch again, I will just be replacing over the new RH8 that I'm putting in the MOC just now. That's you guys, it is absolutely easy to hit this glitch. Big shout out to obviously myself and my boy Tango for this. We worked hard on it over the past couple of days and to be honest, I don't think it's finished there. I think we've got more to come. So, as you'll see there, I have just replaced over the stock Elegy. That has now been moved to my MOC, ready to replace with another duplicate. So, as you can see guys, two retro customs in my facility now, both with clean plates. Hell yeah! No custom plates required. So, me and Bruntango actually worked on this to make it as easy as possible for you guys. It started off with a whole bunch of steps and we narrowed it down to this very fast, very easy glitch. 